Hi guys, welcome to my X journeys. If you watch my previous videos on my Chanel unboxing with my classic long wallet, you guys know I had to stop filming and then I brought you guys to a little vlog because I got this offer. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please consider to subscribe. And of course, my channel talks about many things about Hermes, like how I score my items and my experience with Hermes and some Hermes shopping flock. And of course, I also include some other luxury items that I score. So, and today, obviously, I am doing another Chanel unboxing. Please guess what I've been waiting for this piece to come. You know, what piece that I got this time. So without further ado, let me just take the ribbon off. And while you guys are placing your guess. Okay. So let me open it for you guys. You guys can see. And then, and then of course, here's the card. And I will show you guys the price in a little bit. Okay, so without further ado, let me just take the ribbon off again. And if you guys been watching me unboxing the Chanel, I mean you guys know how much I love this. Camilla flowered. Just really like the glitter. Okay. Okay. So let me unbox this piece. Ooh, I really like the box. It's like magnetic. Let me take this off. Here's the dust bag. So before I open this, let me see what else is in the box. Of course, here's the microfiber wipe. I really like to use this to wipe my Chanel bag every time after I using it, and then here's the care booklet, of course. Okay. And let me just put away this box. Okay, so have you guys guessed what this piece is? I mean, if you guys been following me with my channels and my Instagram, if you have not yet followed my Instagram, please consider to follow. I do leak out more info in Instagram sometimes just because I really couldn't film and edit so soon. Um, but I'm so excited to share with you guys. So usually I would post pictures and stories um, in my Instagram instead. So yeah, you guys can probably guess or not. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, so without further ado, let me just open it, take it out and let you guys see. This is the mini classic flap, which is the rectangular that we say. Ooh, and this is with the Go Tone hardware, which is a champagne girl. And you guys know how much I love the Chanel champagne girl. It's so subtle. Um, it doesn't look old. So let me just open it. Sorry, my hand's been a little dry lately. It's the weather here in the U.S. So let me... Oh, this time they actually wrap it pretty well with a chain. So I like. But it gave me some time to take out the tissue paper. So as I'm opening it, I'm going to show you guys some of my moss shot, you know, because it takes me a while. Okay, so I finally take off my tissue paper. So see how the chain 
is it's so nice i really like the black with the champagne girl the gold tone metal it just looks really really nice as long as it's not yeah the only thing i'm concerned about is just the chain here it does get twisted sometimes um but if you know if you guys have been watching my you know chanel unboxing i do have one that is the micro bag and it actually doesn't have this problem but unfortunately with the mini rectangular I, I do notice you know there's something with a chain that i have to be aware of every single time but it's okay i mean i really love the combinations and guess what this is in lambskin and when i saw this when i feel it i'm like oh this is like a buttery soft and it's and it's so shiny that I really like it. It's like there's really no a second thought when I saw it. It's like this is a piece that I've been looking for from Chanel. And I heard it's really hard to get. Um, I mean, about a month or two months ago, I went to another boutique. And the essay over there offered me a mini rectangular in beige and when i refused when i rejected he told me there's no way you can get a black one it's a long list it's like hermes and i'm like no way it's like hermes so of course i i changed the boutique i just went to another boutique and look i got this piece and of course there's a pocket at the back so let me open this for you guys so that you guys can see and there's a felt i think last time with my white and black mini rectangular they missed the felt if you have not yet watched that unboxing video i'll put the link above and in the description box below so you guys can see and if you guys want to see the comparison between the two please comment below let me know i'll put it on my to-do list so anyway so this is the inside and of course there's a micro chip here nice nice okay so um there's a zipper at the back there's a zipper at the back and i can just you know open this open this piece this is chanel and the interior is black obviously I feel like I'm gonna be using this back very casually. Um, and here's the pocket. Okay, you guys want to know what it's made from? Yes, it's made in France. It, it's just like my the other white and black mini rectangular that is made in France, which is my second piece made in France from Chanel. Um, so yeah, please comment below what you guys think about this piece. Um, and i will tell you just a little bit of story on how i scored this item so i've been looking for the mini rectangular since early november and i did went to therius boutique right before the price increase um which i think it was like november 1st that's i that that's when i was trying to browse around and see there's a mini rectangular i just realized you know chanel has uh, a mini size a mini flap that could be suitable for my use nowadays because you guys know i've been using my mini lindy a lot lately and i really like the size so i was like oh since chanel has such a mini size it's not too much of a difference i mean if you guys want to see the comparison between the mini rectangular and my mini lindy i can surely do that please let me know so i can put some videos in my to-do list if you guys are interested just comment below let me know um so anyway so when i saw they have the mini rectangular i was like okay i think this is something that i want right now so i was browsing around and hopefully hoping that i would get something right before the price increase so in november 1st it is four thousand four hundred dollars so i thought the price increase you know from november 5th i believe that's when the price increase happened it would not be four thousand four hundred dollars anymore but guess what i got this 
23C. I got this $4,400 still. So they did not increase this price for the mini flap, which I was like, well, then I, I better get it now, right? Um, so I'm so lucky and I'm so happy that I met this SA. And this is basically the third bag, the third mini bags that I purchased from her. She's amazing. Um, basically anything I want, she would get it for me, um, which I'm very grateful that she's able to do that. So in between this bag and my white and black mini flap, it was actually only 10 days apart. And I requested this bag doing my purchase on the white and black mini flap. We were expecting it to come around January, like a mid January, like we didn't expect it would come so soon and i was like this is sooner than the other two like the the gap in between the two that the mini square and the mini flap in white and black combination so i was shocked so that's why if you watch my the other video um about my the chanel classic long wallet i had to stop filming just to get this piece because i know it's not easy to get and you know, some people probably, you know, still waiting and I'm so grateful. And of course, um, it was so close to the holiday, you know, with all the shippings and issues that always happen during the holidays. And now with the manpower issues, you know, it can cause a lot of delays. And of course, I was going to leave a few days after because she texted me during the weekend and I'm just like, well, we don't want to risk anything. What if it get lost? So we actually didn't have this shipped to us. I actually have this purchased at the store. Um, so I carry it out on the day of just because I want to make sure this is secure. I love this bag. Um, so I had to purchase on the spot. And that's why I brought you guys to a little vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's videos. If you do, please give me a thumbs up. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please consider to subscribe. And you know, my channel talks about a lot of things about Hermes, including the strategy of buying. And now I would do a lot of, you know, maybe some Chanel unboxing or other luxury items. Um, so if you like all these contents, please consider to subscribe and please comment below and let me know what else of the topics that you guys want to hear. So then I can, like I said, I want to put it in my to-do list and then hopefully I can get more information to you guys. So as always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye.